Hi, this is Tapcat. Welcome back to Darkest Dungeon. We are going to go on a mission to get four more level zeros uh, leveled up. I have a ton. Let me sort by level. Um, so let's see. Going down to the bottom. Even after we get these four taken care of, I'll still have five more guys that need to get you just to level one, forget higher than that. So yeah, we'll bring a full party and, and try to get this going. Now, unfortunately, because none of these guys have gone out before, their skills that they came with are not necessarily the best. So I need to unlock Iron Swan for her as well as Adrenaline Rush. And for him, well, I want Inspiring Cry at a minimum. I kind of want Holy Lance too, but um, I'm going to leave it for now. For her, I definitely need her main heal as well as Dazzling Light. And then we want Battlefield Bandage. And I'll leave it at that for now. Okay, now, it's one thing to buy the abilities, but I also need to equip them. So we'll do that. I'll lose the heal uh, and take Inspiring Cry. For her, I'm gonna dump the Mace and Hand of Light and add Judgment and Dazzling Light. And then here, like so. Okay, so we got those abilities sorted out. And that should be it for now. The uh, one awkward thing about leveling up a bunch of people this way, though, is like how many upgrades that's going to unlock at both the guild and the blacksmith when we get back. But it is what it is. Uh, it is unfortunate that the only apprentice level dungeons I can take are short. There are no medium or long ones. So I think what I will do is go ahead and grab this one. So this will hopefully not be a, you know, super complicated run. Uh, let's see. For a short mission, this is enough for three food tiles. I do have a Vestal, so I don't feel like I need a lot of healing. But, I don't know. I usually go through quite a bit of food. I definitely want a few of those. Two keys should be enough. And, uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to get rid of those. Okay. Okay. I feel okay about this. Let's do it. Yeah, it's unreal to me like how many guys we need to level up. The smell of rotting fish is almost unbearable. Oh boy. Okay, this actually isn't as bad as I was thinking at first. We'll only have to backtrack a little bit. I don't know why, all of a sudden I get this feeling like I had forgotten something. Oh, well, that was mean. Uh, you know what I forgot? I forgot to rename all these guys. They're all level zeros that I'm bringing in for the first time. Okay, after combat. Um, let's use judgment to kill this thing. Give them no quarter. He was the most important thing on the board as far as I'm concerned to take down. All right. Yep. Uh, yeah, let's just kill this guy. Ha ha ha. 
Well, this is a perfect blind fire. Oh, you missed. All right, let's try to slow his roll. There we go. Now we can beat the crap out of him at our leisure. Alright. them all. Okay. Let me uh, let me consult with my list of names here. If I can find it. Okay. Yuna Lizard, you're in. And for my Vestal, whoops. You will be Caden uh, Dotson. And the Crusader will be Jonathan. And for my Hellion, you can be Zoth. All right. Sorry about that. I should have taken care of that before we started recording. Okay, now as I remember, I had somebody, yeah, like weak grip is really bad. And if I want to do low light runs, uh, well, diurnal is really bad too. Uh, but the yips is horrible. Okay, since that's his only one, let me just make sure nobody else has one that's even worse than that. No, although like honestly, these are all pretty bad. <laughs> But let's get rid of the yips. All right. Yeah, having a worse chance to hit every single time you take a swing, not really going to help us a whole lot. Now, you know what I thought I might do on this run? Um, yeah, let's grab these. Is try a low light but not no light run. So maybe we'll try to keep it around 50. Annihilated. Love to see that. Never gets old. Um, that should mean we would get better loot. Not as good as no light. I understand that. But, well, this will just be a kill. So. As the fiend falls beautiful blossoms. let's go ahead and stun one of these clowns if we can did it I'm gonna have to start doing some stress heals too unfortunately okay uh yep let's do this miss Ah, you didn't miss. What does that do? Yeah, that's not terrible. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Inspiration and improvement. Okay. I'll do that. And I don't know, I actually wouldn't mind prolonging this and doing another stress heal. Nice. And while I'm at it, I'll the just, you know. Pumps. The limbs obey. Nice, that'll give him a stress heal. Okay, so I'll hit him. And then we'll just kill these guys. I'm not trying to be, you know, a jerk about it. Their formation is broken. But I do want to try to work down their stress as we go along. 
Um, I'll go ahead and do a heal really quick, though. We can still kill him this round. Nice. Okay. You're done. Destroyed. I was so tempted to do one more stress heal, but... That's being greedy. Such a burden of finery. Risks life and limb. Okay. I don't remember. I don't think we had scouted this room. Okay, well, there was nothing in there anyway. Okay, well, let's go check out this curio. Pick up a torch from a trouble. And a couple of busts. Okay. Alright, so this is the only backtracking we'll have to do. We can get back to just running a straight path through here. I'm glad about that. Actually, I'll probably go down this hallway and back now that I think about it. Because I'd like to get whatever that curio is. You know what I hadn't thought about before is, uh, do I have anybody in here that's going to be good at disarming traps? I'm not sure I do. That could be a problem. 60, 50, 50, and 50. Well, uh, do you feel lucky, Zoth? Watch your step. Ah. That was a little rough. Part of the, part of that is being level zero, but part of it is the Ooh, nice. task well performed. Part of it is just the fact that um these aren't classes that have high disarm. I don't have a highwayman or a grave robber or you know, any of them. So that's unfortunate. Okay, I can pick up some food, although I don't know how badly I need it. But you don't just get food. Yeah, I was going to say. I tell you, I am noticing the treasure is improved. Well, I am just going to go ahead and eat that, even if I only get one value. Uh, okay, this is worth 750 which is the same as that. I could get rid of the item in them. That's fine. It's fine. And uh, have we seen this? Yes, many times. I think I keep getting them uh, because of the fact I keep having to delete it before I bring it back. If I was able to bring it back to um, town, I'm pretty sure then I would never see that one again. Corruption. Um, but let me see, Is, am I going to use holy water for anything in here? Potentially I could get a damage buff, but that's all right. Um, so the question is, do I want to bring this, which is worth a thousand gold or the crests? I actually have a decent amount of crests right now, but like we, we need a ton overall in the game. I tell you what, I'll lose the bandage and I'll grab both. But I'm I'm starting to run out of stuff Later that I gold, ugh, trinkets and baubles paid for in blood. I think I'm just gonna have to let the onyx go. Huh? Is it just me, or are there are very few actual encounters for some reason? I just feel like we're not having the number of fights I would normally expect. And unfortunately, that means we're not going to get, you know, the treasure I would normally expect either. Well, this is a fight. 
so my biggest thing is like I have to kill this guy. If I can get the Arbalist uh, turn before one of these guys guards him, then I got this. Let's do this. Yeah, he only has 25% stun resist. So. Done. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> he guards the other tank. Okay, you know what? There. Now I don't need the Arbalist. And she instead can go after this guy. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's really nice. God, now I gotta stress heal her all because I had to do that stupid trap. Uh, okay, nobody actually needs a heal, so why don't we just go for a stun here? Let's get rid of the guard. I mean, I don't... Oh, no, I can't. Alright, let's do this. Okay, uh, I am going to do this. Nobody else is, you know, in bad shape stress-wise, but I, I need to get some stress heals on her, man. I'll boost her speed. And... Yeah, just whack this guy, I guess. Start chipping away, eh? You know what? I'll do this. Alright, hit the wrong guy, but whatever. She should go first from now on. I don't think the three points was really going to be that big of a deal, no matter what. Yeah, let's try. Beautiful. I'm, I wanted to do a stress heal, but I'm actually glad I didn't. Just because getting to where only one of these guys can attack, it, it actually matters quite a bit. Oh, right. I can't target that first spot. Alright, and I can't... Um, yeah, I can't get use a bandage to get rid of her bleeding because I used the bandage. Uh, let's do this. I'll stun him this time. I'll heal her in a minute. Now, I'll also do a stress heal. And, the, yeah, the crit buys her some extra, which is nice. We're getting her down. I think if I do even one more, you know, that's pretty good. And I'll just keep chipping away at this idiot's health. All right. Um, I'll do this. Yeah, that's fine. Too bad it wasn't a crit, but I'll live. All right. Oh, brother. It's getting lower, but he's not there yet. Yeah, I'll just kill him. I would like to get her... Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? All right. Let's go. Not quite that much. Uh, so it's not locked. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Well, there's only one more room. So we're getting down to it here. Come on, guys. Give me some loot. Give me some real loot. Or hit me with a trap. That's good, too. That's it. Wow, okay. What a big middle finger. Like, I worked so hard to manage our stress through the whole dungeon, and then just the last thing, it hits me with an invisible trap. We will find all manner of great and terrible okay. things in this watery tomb. Well, I've gotten more loot, uh, for sure, in a dungeon before, but 
My main stated, you know, goal here was to level all four of these guys up. I did do that. And I got rid of one really nasty negative quirk. So that's good. And heretics skulk in the alleys. They must be found out. Oh, this is pretty good. So ZDX would go up to level five. Holy crap, man. Okay. Um, yeah, so it looks like uh, Kronos got stress healed. Let's, um, let me just see if I sort by stress. So nobody is like super bad. He's got 40. She's got 47. She's my worst as far as stress goes. So that's good. That's good. And then let me see. Um, who's the boss? The siren. Okay. That's who we can fight now in the cove. And then a short one. So we can do a medium one now if we want to. I also have a medium one here. Okay. So we have a bunch of medium apprentice level ones. So that's kind of good because, you know, honestly, what I'm thinking about is if we just take a, a mostly at least level zeros through again and we just get more money this time, you know, I mean, I basically broke even last time, except for the fact like if I come in here, let's just do this really quickly. Um, so if we look at these guys, see now all this stuff opens up. The good news is it's pretty cheap, you know. By the way, can I, uh, no, I need a lot more portraits. So, I mean, you know, that's fine. I don't mind spending that, but it's all money. Uh, yeah. I mean, honestly, this power is more than worth upgrading to. And then for her, I'm really only ever going to use those four. But see, like, it's already thousands of gold and I haven't hit the blacksmith yet. So, it's a thing. I used up more than 3,000 gold. And then if I come in here... This is going to be basically 900 more. So 3,600 more to get the weapon and armor upgrade. And then realistically, they all need survival skills unlocked. They're all missing basic stuff. Like she doesn't have sharpened spear, she, you know, wound care, all this stuff. Pep talk, you know, it doesn't mean I have to do it all right now. Uh, but, like, I would definitely want encourage if we were going to go camping. So, if I brought them on a medium length one, you know, I would want those skills if I could possibly have them. So, okay, well, I'm not going to spend all that money right now because I don't know that I'm bringing any of them on the next mission. And I would much rather spend money as I need to and not just spend it now because, hey, eventually I'll want it. You know, well, then I'll spend the money eventually. Uh, so I am thinking we would need a healer that uh, that's not already in this group. But maybe I could bring three of these guys on a mission and then either an occultist or a vestal. So, um, yeah. All right. Well, we'll look at that when we come back. But that's all for now. Thanks for watching. I hope we see you next time.